Hey everyone, it's Kesmir, and I'm back with The Walking Dead. Um, it looks like we're formulating a plan to escape Carver's compound. Um, hopefully we don't get Clem killed here, because they're boosting her up to climb a rope to go get us a radio. Let's see how things go. It's pretty scary. I thought Carver and his guys are like watching the walls and stuff. Try to hurry, all right? I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. They see you're not in your bunk, we're all done. Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. Ooh, look at them all. We're in trouble. That's a lot. Oh boy, this is scary. Is this what I'm supposed to go into? I hope so. Oh yeah, there's the radios down there. Scary guys. The new people in. See, it's hard not to call them prisoners. Anyway, I'm looking at it now. I don't think we have what we need. Jesus, really? We repurposed a lot of shit to get this place built. I can't say for sure if we even had the materials before we started expanding. Do we have two guys? You can't be smoking back here. Vince, come on. Don't give me that. If Bill smells a whiff of smoke back here, he'll flip. What are you thinking? You know what? I'm just gonna tell him. I'm not letting someone else get blamed for this. That's bullshit. Vince! Vince, come on! Vince! Thanks, Vince. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. I like him. Bed. Troy will be back any minute. Well, got him. Everybody stay where you are. No need drawing suspicion. 
That was so cool. Thank you, Clem. I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. I know it. I'm awesome. Thanks. Yep. Anyway, get some rest. I thought about Duck today, about his dumb little face. First things that come to mind are always the dumb things he was doing. Kid was always running in circles. Every damn place he went, he'd just run. He couldn't stop him. Makes it harder to remember he was a good boy. Oh, Kenny. Well, long day tomorrow. One long day. All right, we're all here. Someone's got to get the radio out to Luke. What's the problem? We should probably figure out who's doing what before we... Time to get up. Daylight's burning. They let you sleep in, all things considered. Where's my dad? He's where the rest of you are going. To work. Rebecca, Nick, Sarah, Jane. If you gotta take a piss, do it now. The next break won't be for a while. Troy will be coming up for the rest of you. Why just them? Like I said, Troy's coming for the rest of you. Rot roll. All right, look. If we're gonna do something, we have to do it now. And if Luke's all we got, and we pair up with him, I can do it. Where's the meeting? Mike. Yeah? Clementine should do it. Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> no offense, but come on. That's crazy. She's a kid. Why would... There's a million reasons. She knows Luke. She can hide. She got the damn radio for us in the first place. Who cares? And I'm sorry, Mike, but I don't know you from fucking Adam, all right? And if I'm trusting someone to do something this important, I'm trusting her. Kenny's right. I should do it. Don't do something stupid just to get some respect. She doesn't need your respect. Give me the radio. All right, little chickens. Let's get to pecking. All right. And don't think today's gonna be like yesterday. No way. No shenanigans. This rooster's gonna be surveilling your ass every second of the day, you hear? Got that? I'm afraid I need an answer, girl. Yes, sir. Come on. Oh, you have your pockets all out. Gonna get your tags all snagged on something. Oh, let's go. Yeah, jeez. That coat came in handy for how ugly it is. Hey, she's with me? Oh shit, I almost forgot. Yeah. Well, take her then. I don't care. Wait, wait, what's going on? Never mind. Just chores of a different sort. Come on, city mouse. Can't you cut her a break? She'd really rather keep with us, people she knows. What... what are we doing? Don't worry about it. Come on. Calm down, Kenny. Don't give us away. I just wanted to make sure you were all right. I didn't believe you when you told me about Reggie. I ran and found Bill once I left you. Figured even if he had done it, he'd make up some sort of excuse, but Bill was just so matter of fact about it. Like he'd pulled up a weed or something, like it had to be done, and that was just one of those moments when your blood runs cold. Goose pimples up and down your arm. Goose pimples. It turns out the person you thought you knew was never there. You look anxious, Clementine. Something the matter? You know 
you can talk to me, right? I was dishonest when I first met you, but I swear on everything holy that'll never happen again. You can trust me. Bonnie, oh. Luke's waiting for me to give this to him. He needs it. Clementine, and all I need from you is to just not care where I am for 15 minutes. Come on, Bonnie. If you get caught and you mention my name, Carver will be the least of your troubles. Okay? Well, what are you waiting for? At a girl, Bonnie. At a girl. Y'all better hurry that shit up. I hate babysitting you assholes. Luke? Shut the door? Shut the door. That looks really old. He's probably fine. Luke, where is he? Luke, if you're hiding, come out. Oh gosh. I swear to Christ, you're gonna regret this. I was. You ain't supposed to be out here. You people been here one fucking day and already you're fucking up. Will you wait and see what happens? Move! Hey! What the heck? Where was Luke? Get over there. And how is it that we're repaid for our trust? With treachery? With deceit? Oh, Luke. Theft. What's going on? I don't know, Clem. Whatever you were planning is over. It's done. You can't just run from your problems. You can't just up and leave when it gets Dang tough. it. Because there's nowhere else you can go where it ain't. Is it because we've trusted Bonnie? Get that through your fucking skulls. Luke here, he can't help you now. You gotta help yourselves. You gotta help me find the strength to forgive you. Now you can start by telling me where the other one is. I'm gonna count to three. If that radio ain't in my hand by then, we'll have to make things more difficult. One, two, I got, I got it right here. Oh, Kenny. It's all right. Gosh darn it. Sorry about that. Not sure what I was thinking. Three. Darn it. Bill! That's enough, Bill! Please! Did you rat us out, Bonnie? Bill, there's a breach. All right, everyone come with me. Bonnie, you stick around. Make sure these folks don't get into any more trouble. Yeah, okay. Did you rat us out, Bonnie? Tonight. Maybe an empty stomach will give you some perspective. Then we'll try this again tomorrow. 
rest with him, Carlos. You need to get him able to move, because we're leaving tonight. We're leaving tonight. So she must have just found him then. Good, I was really worried that I trusted Bonnie. <laughs> I figured Bonnie rat ratted this out. I bet you Kenny would have stepped in no matter what we did. What'd she say? She said she can get us out of the pen if we can get the PA system going. Second she hears it, she'll run over and spring it. That's great. It's not great. What are you talking about? Look, I know part of this is my fault. I, I, I know. I was hungry, I got reckless trying to steal some food, and I got caught. We can't stay here. Exactly. We have no idea how long Alvin's got before Bill just kills him. We have to leave now. Look, I hear what you're saying, but it's risky. I think we have it's to take Bill out. Risky, guys. risky? Did you see what that son of a bitch just did? Look, the plan works. Nothing needs to change. It's all set up. The hard part is done. This guy's fucking crazy. Who knows what he'll do next? Yeah, but now we're dealing with a guy beat to shit. Sarita in no shape to do anything, and I'm a goddamn mess. Look, we should rest up. Okay, we should bide our time, and we should wait for an opening. Bonnie's agreeing to help us tonight. And that doesn't mean she can't do it some other night. I don't know, guys. Luke's making sense. Maybe we should wait. We're not waiting. Ain't nothing out there, guys. Trust me, I looked. There's no food. There's no supplies. They picked everything clean. I'm just saying we gotta be sensible about this. We need to leave now. It's only gonna get worse. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. Is he gonna be okay? His orbital is crushed. I don't think there's much hope for the eye. Oh. I got him as stable as I could, cleaned it, got some of the swelling down, bandaged it as best I could. But until he wakes up, you won't know if there's any damage to the brain. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, look. Maybe I'm just playing devil's advocate here, but if... Damn it, if y'all are serious about going tonight, then we're gonna have to start talking about maybe leaving some folks behind. No! There is no other way. This is bullshit. Well, I don't like it either, but guess what? It's where we're at. Kenny and I are only here because of you people. And now you intend to leave us behind. So we should risk all of our lives? What are you saying? Nothing. I'm, I'm just thinking out loud here. Ugh. We're not leaving Kenny. That's not fair. We stay together. Life ain't fair, Clem. We're just trying to make the best of a bad situation here. No one wants to leave Kenny. Oh, Kenny. I'm all right, huh? We leave tonight. Plan don't change. Not bad, old man. Thanks, asshole. You are one tough bastard. Do tough bastards get their ass kicked in front of everybody? You all right? That wasn't your fault, okay? It's all right. Well, then what now? We get the hell out of here. Like now, now? Yes. Where are we going? In case things get squirrely and we gotta make a break for it, we need a place to meet up. We could meet out at Parker's Run. The hell is that? It's a Civil War site a few miles north. Tourist trap. Got signs all over. Just follow the road. We stopped there after we escaped the first time. Luke and Carlos know where it is. It's not that far. Well, at least if a few folks know where it's at, it'll be easier to find if we're split up. All right, that works. Then we just need someone to go set off that PA, right? I mean, you never bother to explain who's supposed to do that. Right here.
because Clem does everything. Wait, wait, hold on. She's the plan? <laughs> why is it always me? <laughs> one, one of them was, why is it always me? <laughs> Be sure to remember to flip the switch for the outdoor speakers. Just the indoor speakers might not draw the herd. It's right on the microphone box. Right. My default is set to play music, so you should just have to turn it on, right? Then climb back up and drop into the stock room. We'll meet you there. Down into the office. Outdoor speaker switch. Turn on PA. Up to the roof. Down into the stock room to meet you guys. That right? Perfect. Be careful. Okay. Clem, make sure you bring Alvin. If he's mobile. Alright guys, we're going to end this one here right on a cliffhanger. Right before we do the mission. So like, comment, subscribe. See you in the next one. Catch me around.